If you guys want to see some of the lightest shoes in the world, check out this video. All right, so when you're traveling, you're backpacking. I generally try to have lighter stuff. I try to carry less things, uh, lighter, lighter gear if I can. And so in the past, you know, six or eight months or so, I've been looking at different gear to try to cut down on waist, cut down on weight and size and everything. And, you know, just make sure I'm utilizing everything properly. The biggest part for me were my sandals, my shoes. Um, well, not the biggest, the backpack or whatever, but one of the big things were definitely my shoes and sandals. And so I was very careful to find the right pair of shoes and the right pair of sandals for my my backpacking you know, trip that I'm doing here in the spring. It's gonna be like six or 12 months or so, depending. But these, these shoes and sandals, I wanted them to be able to take up little space and be very light. So the sandals that I, I found are these X shoes, X zero shoes. I think it's zero shoes, but it's spelled with an X. Uh, these things are great. They're sandals and they are super minimalistic, super durable, super strong. Um, I've gone running in them. You can go on long hikes with them. If you go on a hike with them for longer than two or three, feet, two or three miles or you know, five, you know, four to five kilometers, you definitely will feel it on your feet. Your feet have to be stronger to wear these. So don't go out and try to do like a 10 mile hike or 20 mile hike starting off with these shoes because your feet definitely have to get used to them. That you definitely uh, get stronger feet by wearing these kind of shoes. If you generally are barefoot or you've done a lot of hiking or walking around barefoot, then these shoes are perfect for you because your feet will stay cleaner and they, will, they won't get scratched or you have a lesser chance of them getting punctured um, from you know glass or rocks or whatnot. And even if glass, you know, you do step on glass with these things, these things are super durable. They're really, really tough. It's like tire, tire, tire rubber, like super thick, um, well, super thin, but like, it feels like it's super thick. Like, I feel like I could just poke a nail, let's see if I got a needle over here. No, I don't have a nail or anything, but I feel like I could just take a nail and poke it at it, and it wouldn't, I could step on one and, um, it would puncture it, but like a piece of glass that's on its side maybe be fine. These things are much more, much more durable, obviously, than your bare feet. And if you're, you know, doing a lot of hiking and whatnot, uh, and you're switching between your shoes and your sandals, these they they wrap around your feet so well that I can go running in them, I can go hiking in them. They're phenomenal, uh, and they take up very little space. So what you can do is you can actually roll them up. And see how small I can get these guys. So you can roll them up, maybe put a string around them or a hairband or something, and you can put this in your bag. Put it in a plastic bag in case they're wet or dirty, but then you can put it in your bag and it takes up very little space. Compared to a lot of mainstream sandals, this takes up as much space as probably the heel of the sandal. The end of the sandal on uh, a lot of you know sandals that you'd get like reefs or whatnot and they take up a lot more space but these these are great because they are very durable they take up very little space and they're really not too crazy expensive i think you can get this same pair um, the cloud pair whatever version this is for 20 to 50 dollars on their website i will put links in the description box for their website and then if i have any affiliate links i'll put that as well for Amazon if they sell it on Amazon or if they distribute through there. But um, I will be making another video about my shoes, my, my hiking waterproof shoes that I spent, um, I think, yeah, six to nine months looking for these shoes and found them. These are the perfect shoes for what I'm trying to do and the way I travel. And uh, I just wanna share that with you guys. Hopefully these, these gives you guys some good information on the X Zero shoes or the Zero Zero shoes, uh, the sandals. And if you guys want me to do any more reviews on other stuff, just let me know. If you wanna check out some of the other reviews in the description box for other gear that I've done, um, views on or that I am using for my backpacking trip I will and then soon I'll be making a big video on my entire backpack and I'll, I'll make a video about the backpack but I'm also going to make a video about all the gear that I'm taking with me um, everything that I own for traveling the world and yeah hopefully you guys you guys enjoyed this video if you did 
um, just like and if you have any questions or if there's anything that you want me to go over or other videos you want me to make I'm really looking for any ideas for cool videos to make so if you want to put them in the description box that would be awesome not in the description box if you want to put them in the comment box that'd be super cool otherwise guys I'm ranting talking too much I'm gonna go but um, you guys have a great day take care peace out